Hi everyone, it's Carolyn from True Crime Chat with Mommy Ramblings. We have a very sad update in the search for missing two-year-old Rory Pope, who was visiting his grandparents' house in Idaho, Eagle, Idaho, from California. As the family was packing up, little Rory went missing, and that was Wednesday at 12.15 p.m. His body has been found in the pond behind the house once it was drained. So let's let's go over this very, very sad update. The Ada County Sheriff's Office said that the body of missing two-year-old Rory Pope has been discovered after authorities worked to drain a pond near where the boy went missing. They announced it in a tweet this morning the pond was behind North Arena Avenue in Eagle in the Legacy subdivision. That's where he went missing when his family was loading up the car to leave after visiting the grandparents. Crews spent all night pumping water out of the pond, the tweet said. He was found when the water level dropped. Hundreds of Eagle police, Boise police, Ada County Sheriff's Office, FBI agents, and neighborhood volunteers searched for Rory after he went missing. Again, that was Wednesday around 12.15 p.m. So, very, very sad update. Then there was another um, post on the Facebook page for the Find Rory Pope. And it says, it is with very sad heart, I was asked to make this statement by Rory's grandfather just a few minutes ago. Rory's body was recently found in the pond behind the grandparents' home. The Eagle Police Department and the Ada County Sheriff's Department will not be making an official announcement until later today. At the family's request, I was asked to ask all of you amazing volunteers to please vacate the areas close to their home, including the bridge out of respect for them. In addition, they do not need any more food, water, etc. delivered to their home. Please be respectful of them in this very difficult time. Please do not post pictures you've personally taken of the pond or surrounding areas. Also, the grandfather mentioned to me to ask you all not to make comments on this page about what you think could have been done differently. Again, be respectful of them and put yourself in their shoes. The family is so grateful for everything, the community, the city, the state. I'm sorry, my I just, um, and all first responders have done to assist. You've all been amazing. Thank you. Please keep the family in your prayers. And we will keep the family in our prayers. And, of course, a little worry. Very sad ending. Nobody wanted to see that. But I think as the time ticked down, we knew that something was, you know, really, this probably wasn't going to end very well. A little two-year-old out there, they had extreme heat. You know, my other thought was that he had crawled into something maybe, but uh, yeah, nobody wanted to find this. But when that pond was drained, his body was found. So again, keep the family in your prayers. Rest in peace for a little worry. And that's, that's it for this sad update. Thanks for watching, and I hope you all have a great day. Bye now.